Traffic Chief Dion Moore today called on Commissioner of Police David Ramnawain to allocate additional resources to the Traffic Department so that its Christmas security traffic posture could be successful. Moore was at the time presenting the Traffic Department's Christmas security posture at the Force Headquarters Eve Levy Monday morning. What we are not satisfied with at the moment is the amount of vehicles that we have to patrol by night. Having recognized the need for patrols by night along the especially East Bank, East Coast Borbys areas where we find accidents occurring mostly between the period between darkness and daylight. It is not safe for us to put motorcycles during that hour, so we need more four vehicles that we can patrol the roads and take action. In this regard, I think, I think, or would be happy if for some reason Commissioner Acting sees it fit to allocate to the traffic department at least three additional four-wheel motor cars so we can we can um, patrol the roads, especially especially East Bank Corridor, East Coast, and West Demerara. You would have recognized that West Demerara Road, even though it has been constructed, to me it is incomplete because there is no separation of vehicle traffic and pedestrians. There's only a single line and the road is very wide and it's a heaven to welcome speed. So there is a need for us to patrol that road regularly. He said that his department is however satisfied with the number of breathalyzers, radar guns to detect speed and in some cases speed humps in various divisions to address various cases of road lawlessness. Intention is to maintain the free flow of traffic and to minimize as far as practical, practicable accidents and congestion and or inconvenience. We will focus heavily on our enforcement in that regard these areas we will specifically be looking at, especially diagonal parking during this period. We know that there are are inadequate space for all the vehicles to park. Coupled with inadequate public transportation. In all divisions, we will have patrols by day and night with motor cars and motorcycles. There you see, we will be utilizing the crash trucks that we have to tow away vehicles that would have parked illegally, causing obstruction to others. Moore said in cases where there is congestion, police escorts will be provided to those who are entitled to such. He added that the police will be utilizing CTTV footage extensively in the divisions in and around Georgetown to rope in errant road users. Patrols will also be conducted in several parts of Georgetown, especially and the patrol timings will overlap to facilitate for a proper change of shift. The targeted areas are Carifesta Avenue, Starbuck Market, Border Market, Regent and Camp Streets, Main and Water Streets, among others. Also, there will be traffic ranks placed at several junctions in an effort to facilitate convenient traffic movement. Leroy Smith, Newsroom.